Hello Internet, my name is Maxis Wildborn, and welcome to another One Night at Flupties 2 video, Hard Boiled Mode. Do you think we can survive this day? <laughs> I've got so many attempt videos on this that it's ridiculous. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, is it even possible for me to beat this? I mean, I know all the mechanics, I just have very bad timing and you'd be surprised on how that is a huge factor in all this. I mean I could easily just cheese the game and just do that for a good portion of the day, but how 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 interesting is that? I mean that's not a video, that's you know Power Management Simulator 2015. That's basically what that is, and I'm not that's not my kind of life. I'm not all about that. Oh my. Yes, I threw that. I was not about to get exposure on the very first peak. Come on now. I'm not. I'm not ab I'm not about that. Time for me to to get some strats in. That's my strategy. If I get exposure on the first peak then you done fucked up. Rub the cheetah for good luck. I'm gonna hover my ass over that daggum flip switch. You bet your Sally sisters that's what I'm gonna do. Make subtle movements. I don't even think I ever have to not have my. F oh, actually, I got to for the vent button side. So. That's right. Shit. Yeah, it's a little past the, the flip switch when the camera starts turning, so. Oh, go, oh, go, oh, go. Why do you go after that vent? It's closed. Douche. I don't want to cheese the night. I don't want to just do that. And just peek every now and then to see if the owl's there. That's boring. That's not That's not a video. I may have to employ that strategy if I want to beat this. I swear. Shit. Whoa, blam! Yeah. Get out of here. Fuck. I think Grunkfest will be the next one to attempt to jump scare on me. That's what he looks like. I mean, look at the way he's staring at me. There's Blam. There's Eyesore. Blam will be the next one to jump in. Get out of here. Deeky, deeky, deeky. <laughs> okay, over there. Ooh, Grunkfus. It's not fully charged. Sorry about them peoples with OCDs. Get on out of here. Wait, did I get exposure on the very first peak? If I did, I'm very disappointed in myself. Very disappointed in myself. Like, that's not the life for me. Was not gonna gamble the charge. Was not gonna do that. Alright. Alright, he's coming in through there. 
bothers me when he does that. I don't know if it's a 50-50 chance on like which one he goes down, but I thought he was a little biased that he'd go down the uh, the way that you'd have open. That's the implication I got. You're next. So hi everyone, welcome to another episode of- No, I'm kidding. <sighs> I missed a little song, at least that's like... The, you know, the cheer speech for, like, the morality speech. For the beginning of the night. That we usually have during my nights at work. I need to make a blog video to tell you guys what I've been going through and where I'm at currently and what I've been doing. Uh, wait. I can't. Oh, okay, yeah, so he is down red. Alright, that's fine. I figured that's where he'd be. Alright. No. Flumpty would be a big asshole if he just blocked the freaking urinal, like the entire thing. Actually, he already does. I mean, like, if he blocked the owl standing on it, and you couldn't tell if he was gone or not, it would suck. Like, see that look, it, you know. If he was just gonna be a huge douchebag. I don't know where Blam is. Uh, there's Blam. Alright then. I think Eyesore's on the, also on his way. Good check him. Fucking camera! Then the owl. Uh, I was kind of screwed over a little bit there. Which happens. Alright, true face time. Even though true face doesn't really help really much. Gotta really concentrate here. I gotta get this done. That piglet doesn't make noise when you. T I w actually would never poke that. That that's just that's syphilis right there. That doesn't even make any sense anyway because piglet's a stuffed animal. Why does he got guts and blood? First of all. Same for the first game, Winnie the Pooh was kind of gutted, like he was completely separated from his lower half. And what's worse is that there's not a single drop of hun- I'm gonna ignore that I got a bit of exposure from that first peak. But anyway, there was not a drop of honey in that. I mean, if you dissected Winnie the Pooh, chances are you're gonna- You're gonna- Get some honey out of that. We the people got a giant hole in it. I wonder if, um, the act of uh, Gronkfuss coming out of the Declaration of Independence is uh, a metaphor for something about our American government, which I wouldn't really, I wouldn't really like disagree, because I do think our our country is being led by a bunch of clowns. I don't think they know what the hell they're doing. I was completely expecting that. But mostly because I wasn't paying attention. I'm over here talking about politics, which is not even a subject I follow. But I need to, because a lot of crap's going on. 
And it won't be long before this country falls. I'm dead serious. Evil triumph when good people do nothing. It's the only way. Good people need to stand up. Alrighty. Uh, I'm still a little disturbed by this image right here. That's a nice picture, though. Shit. Oh, you come from over there? Why do I always get a sliver of exposure from the first Flumpty Peak? Why? I mean, he's the slowest to actually look when he appears at the door. <sighs> he's so goddamn random. It makes it. This, he makes this game a little harder to predict. I think everyone else has their own, like, timing. Maybe like if like for instance, if Blam enters this room, he will um, I'm just gonna go ahead. And, oh well, like if Blam is in this room, he will leave or he'll change position in that room either 20, 30, or 40 seconds, and then it just randomly chooses between those. That's what I'm thinking. God damn it. Okay. I don't want to stop talking in order to beat this thing. Because, you know, this is a commentary video. Kinda. A let's play. And that's kinda boring when you're not talking, but... Let's give it a try. Let's not talk. Let's just play the game and see if we can beat it. I may make a comment from here, there, you know. Spice things up, but from now on, I'm going to remain as minimalistic commentary as possible. that potato.
probably just scared the shit out of me. for the people talking in the background. It's fine. No distractions. Just kidding. Oh my god! It worked! <laughs> oh my god. Beating an egg, kidnapped person wins Plumpty Bumpty's game. After countless citizens of New Dork have been abducted by the mysterious Plumpty Bumpty to play his survival hide and seek game, one of his bested or one has bested Flumpty and earned the privilege of becoming Flumpty's new best friend. Allegedly, Flumpty has constructed a skinless many head monster out of the corpses of his game's unfortunate past contestants. There's also minor messages um, written around the uh, newspaper. Written there by John O'Cron. I don't know if this is something that stays here until I click, or whatever. Yes, it is. Shit, I could have read those things. Oh well, there's our star. We get a star. Yay. My name is Megs Wild One. thank you so much for watching my video, and I don't know what I'll be playing next, but I will see you in my next video. So until then, have a good one.